The Philippine National Police strongly denied allegations made by a human rights group that it is undercounting the number of fatalities in anti-illegal drug operations under the Marcos administration. Patrick de Jesus has more. The Philippine National Police insist there is transparency in the data on the campaign against illegal drugs. This is their answer to the statement of Human Rights Watch that there is undercounting on the 46 reported deaths in anti-drug operations since the start of the Marcos administration. This is far from the more than 100 recorded in a study of the University of the Philippines. The HRW also called insensitive the PNP statement that the death toll is very minimal. The PNP meanwhile said that they are ready to present the data being questioned by the group. Uh, we even uh, sharing it uh, from the very start, yung mga nahuhuli po natin, yung mga nakukumpiska po natin illegal drugs, and even yung mga casual piece on the side of the PNP. So as far as the PNP is concerned ma'am, yung uh, report po natin na 46 na casualties po sa illegal drugs, ay yun po yung uh, nasa datos po ng PNP. The PNP added that the number of drug users who were successfully rehabilitated should be given focus also. More than 600,000 have graduated the recovery and wellness program of the PNP in partnership with different LGUs. This is more than half of 1.2 million drug surrenderies. These are the indication that the PNP, not only the PNP but the government is really serious when it, uh, with, with, uh, with, when it comes to the uh, uh, our demand reduction program po kung saan na malaki po ang magagawa nito para bumaba po yung ating problema. Kung di man po totally ma-eradicate po yung problema natin sa program. Patrick De Asus, For The Nation.